Hi, my name is Ludas Butkus, and this is a quick crypto market analysis. So, Bitcoin is still going up and is reached a resistance line at around 3200. As you can see, everything is quite green, and in the 24 hours chart, it's kind of going a few percent uh, backwards. But overall, everything is still going up and we see a healthy increase in prices. So, this is more uh, a steam a market analysis today. So, how is steam doing? Well, it's not doing too great, I would have to say. Uh, if we would go to the month chart, as you can see at the top, it was a dollar eighty-eight. If we go three months back, uh, at the top it was almost it was two dollars eighty cents, which was a really high price. And now it just went down, down, down. As you can see, the trend is going down, and it is now only one dollar thirty-six cents which is kind of a bummer because um, it started going down when Bitcoin started going down and I was expecting that when Bitcoin starts to go up it should go up as well and it is going up but only uh, a few percent so um, it's very likely that a lot of people are actually selling off their Steam. Okay, the market cap is actually nothing interesting. What I want to see is the 24 hour volume, which was very super high when it was at the peak. But let's look at the last month. It was kind of high at the peaks, and right now the trading volume is quite stale. It was really low over here when everyone was just holding off to their steam because the price is unacceptably low but it was even here at 80 cents and it has now kind of recovered but it's still going sideways with no real direction uh, let's do go here and let's do go to the charts uh, this is from Poloniex. We see the chart, which is a one hour chart uh, for the last. What, how much? For the last week, or I think, yes, for the last week. Let's go uh, further. Okay. I want at least a month. Let's go to June or July. Okay. So, as you can see, the downtrend is extremely high. The, the trading volume uh, at the bottom is super low. Uh, from uh, the lowest low that we can see over here, the price is recovering a bit but it's very small and overall uh, the market is just in this tunnel well i'm not a trader i'm not drawing the best charts over here the best analysis uh, but the general gist is that the price is kind of sideways and it might go even lower it might start going at least to this point over here but overall the price is struggling to get anywhere so we know there is steam but there is also steam backed dollars uh, that we can see over here uh, this was a huge uh, drop though uh, the price is quite stable right now uh, this is priced in BTC so um, I can't convert it right off my mind so let's go over here 
to SPD. Steam back dollars and yes, it's 95 cents and it should be around dollars. So we are where we should be uh, almost, uh, though we are a bit lower. And I'm guessing it should be around here, around this this line, to be exactly one dollar, because BTC is around three thousand, so zero 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 point three should be around a dollar, I guess, something like that. So it still has to rise a bit, but overall the price has gone down. As you can see, that trend downtrend is similar or even worse than Steam. I, I guess it was worse. If we can go back, if it's not reloaded. Yeah, it's pretty much the same. But that should have been expected because Steam dollars should be one dollar and not more, though it is now less. Uh, hope it will recover soon. And now what I wanted to talk about was that Steamit finally reached 300,000 users and that's a huge uh, milestone that it, it has reached, though it's not something super special. Uh, 1 million will be a much bigger milestone, though compared to other social media sites if we would go uh, social media sites user statistics. If we can find it quickly, so yeah, okay. Facebook is at the top with. 1,877,000,000 users, so we have not even uh, have reached a million. 49, I don't even know what that is. Skype has 300 million, Snapchat 300, Pinterest 150, LinkedIn 106. Uh, so, uh, I wonder where is Reddit? Because, in my opinion, it is the most similar site to to Steam it. Tumblr has 550, and I guess Reddit is not over here. Uh, though overall, there is still a lot of growth coming for Steam it. It's nowhere near the big the big guys, but still, it's a, a huge milestone. And out of all these 300,000 accounts, let's go over here. Okay, there's daily active users, and it hovers around 30,000. The lowest is 22,000, probably at the weekend. And overall, 10% of all the users are active daily, which is quite quite good, but it will probably go down as more users come in and it all starts to dilute. Uh, as more users are coming in, the daily post count is also growing and as you can see it now goes kind of sideways from 40,000 to 80,000 posts a day, and which is quite nice. Daily comment count, daily count creation. And there are at least 8,000 new uh, accounts created daily. Uh, at the low date, there shows to 159, there's 120, etc. But these are probably weekends uh, when now not a lot of action is happening. And these are some. Okay, so future power downs. A lot of people are powering down their Steam it and probably cashing it out. I'm guessing this is the main reason why the Steam price is not rising when it actually should be, in my opinion. But a lot of people are cashing out and probably selling off their Steam. SBD to Steam conversions. Uh, a lot of 
is being converted to steam and may be cashed out uh, and that's all in this site um, and what we have here is the rich list uh, let's get back which eight million five hundred thousand SBD in balance and eighteen what eighteen billion in steam is this possible or am I misreading it? Yeah the main account actually has eighteen billion of steam uh, what is the current supply of steam? Oh yeah, okay, it is possible. Or 18 million. Yeah, 18 million. It should be 18 million. Hmm, that's quite strange. I guess this actually is 18 million, not 18 billion. So there are a lot of rich people that have a lot of steam if they would cash out the market would actually go down to the to pennies for steam but the developers probably won't going to do that though there is a possibility i guess so overall steam is going up uh, the platform is growing there are more accounts uh, being created more posts uh, the rewards pool not sure if i can find a chart for that over here but it has gone quite stable so overall everything is just slowly growing through the summer and I'm guessing we will have a more updates in autumn and there will be something more interesting to show but overall the prices quite low in my opinion I uh, hope it will start to grow soon so this is it for this video hope it was helpful see you in the next one